With Mother's Day here, Rochester mom Kelsey Pendergrass took time to reflect on both her recovery from addiction and becoming a mom. KIMT News 3's Maureen Dudley joins us now with what Pendergrass told her about her story and how it helped set her daughter up for her best chance at life. Maureen. Sananda, in the fall of 2021, Kelsey Pendergrass was pulled over and received a DUI. While in jail, she decided to ask for help for her addiction. Pendergrass went to Minnesota Adult and Teen Challenge for recovery to get her life back on track. Kelsey told me before she went into treatment, she thought about where she was in life and how she always wanted to be a mother. For her, becoming a mom was a different experience. I thought about being in prison pregnant and like being separated from my baby. And that was a really scary thing to think about. After thinking about where she was going to end up because of her addiction, Kelsey Pendergrass knew something had to change. I wanted to start over. And I didn't know if that was possible, but I thought my best chance at that was asking for help. She entered the recovery program at Minnesota Adult and Teen Challenge at six weeks pregnant. Testing for me looked very different. It was preparing my heart for this journey and renewing my soul. From treatment, she gave birth to her daughter, Wilder. She told me her experience has given her an opportunity to help her daughter be empowered and see the strength it takes to ask for help. It's a serious illness that not just not just one that I suffered with, but that other people have too. But for her to see that it can be overcome. When she graduated from the treatment program for women at Minnesota Adult and Teen Challenge, she says her experience helped lay down the groundwork for other moms to be able to have access to their kids while in recovery. I asked Pendergrass what advice she'd give to other parents. To seek out help for yourself and to find all the resources necessary to make that manageable for you and your family before you're forced to. Pendergrass told me she's been sober for the past two and a half years and is grateful for the help and support she received to get to this place with her daughter, Wilder, who, tunes, who turns two in July. Now Pendergrass is working on her degree in teaching and raising her daughter at Rochester's Jeremiah program. Much more, Reen. If you or your loved one need help fighting addiction, help is available. You can call the number here on your screen to speak with a representative from the Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services Administration.